Okay, I ain't got much time, and the, my phone battery's almost dead, so yeah, yeah, I don't have much time. So let's get this on. So I'm late with the channel update, again, because of work, again, too tired, again, and I just, <laughs> plus everybody is fucking partying and shit, and being loud as fuck, drunk as hell, I couldn't really make a video any damn way if I wanted to. Even if I try, excuse me, I did want to, but it just wasn't the right time. So, now that I got the next three days off, I'm walking my black ass home, and we know that anytime I do this, this is the perfect time for me to pass the time as I try to walk up this long, perilous journey to the place known as where I lay my head. So, as you, let's get on with the channel update. You guys know I've been busting my ass this week trying to play. A multitude of games, including Monotony Street Fighter V, which I finally got my first batch of wins, uh, minus the laggy matches. And, uh, yeah, I've been playing the hell out of Dark Siders 2, trying to get that, that game beat. But, you know, I've been, when I thought I had the game beat, because Dark Siders 1 wasn't that long, it was like, no, wait, there's more. And, I guess I'm happy, you know, but that game longer than I anticipated. It's like a whole other section to that game. I don't know if that was supposed to be DLC with the game, with Dark Side of or if that was just how, the, how long the normal game was. But, um, but yeah, I, uh, huh. the game was longer than I anticipated, but I'm still playing it. Goal is to actually beat it. Now, Akiba's beat. That game was just gonna take some some time. It's 16 chapters, and the chapters they get longer. And with a game like that, it's difficult because you're, any RPG you have to find time to grind. You do. You have to find time to grind. And the way the game is set up, or rather, the way that I'm recording the game. I try to, uh, you know, do one chapter per video. You know, like I kind of cut out all the sub events because I read somewhere that in chapter 16 you can go back and you can redo all of them. So I like, fuck it, let me just save some time and try to beat the main story. And if people care to see it, then I'll just go back and I'll do a save file like right before I finish the game. And I'll, um, and I'll just, uh, go back and do all the sub events with their own video of course um yeah the key beat is just going to have to take some time I can't really beat that one sitting like I want to so that's underway and of course we got games coming out uh within the next couple weeks I think we got Marvel vs. Capcom Infinite being released um uh what was it this month what was it next month? I think we also got Assassin's Creed Origins coming this month. Uh, or is it that? Or was, or was that in October? I don't know. I can't remember because I don't have my. Um, obviously, I'm not on my laptop. I, I can't just look up GameFly while I'm recording. So I'm kind of just passed out right now. But yeah, we got a few games coming. But as far as the games I have right now, I am going to do uh, some videos. On the new Overwatch season, you guys been seeing me. I've been ripping it with Orissa. I haven't really used anybody else. Once Orissa came, out, uh, Zaraya was was the bait, and then Orissa came. Out. She's basically like, in many ways, she's a better version of of, of Zaraya. Even though I think uh, Zaraya technically. She can do more damage if you can get her shield on people at the right time, which I do know how to do. Like, you got to do them while they're in the middle of getting fired on. That way you can get your booster. And you got to activate yours while they're in the middle of getting fired on. But if they can reduce her cooldown by a few seconds, yeah, I think she'll be she'll be good. But I guess with a, with a passive like that, they, they, they can't just let you just spam the, the shields. You got to know when to activate them. But... Yeah, I'm definitely gonna play more Overwatch, and I may, um, I may, may not be able to live stream if I if I want the best.
best connectivity because like I've been saying for like the past few months, it seems, my internet isn't the best uh, internet. So it's not really good for live streaming as well as playing online because then the signal is going to be weak I'm trying to decide whether or not it wants to do one or the other. So I may just have to record the matches offline and just upload it. Um, the Street Fighter 5 but not videos. Uh, I've been getting better with that. I'm, I'm getting more familiar with my controls. And I got, like I said, I got my first batch of wins with Monot um, in, in my Labor Day session yesterday. Because the, the Labor Day session was actually kind of last minute. I didn't really know what to do. I wanted to do something. Coming home from work, I was kind of tired. So I was like, fuck it. Let me just jump online and play with Monot some more. Um, you know, she's a learning curve, like I said. And when I do get better with her, I think I'm going to do like a montage of how I, I used to be with her versus how I am at the time I do get to the point where I feel like I can take her in a ring. But um, I think that's a, a cool video, you know, from like past to present. But, um, but yeah, I, uh, Let's see, I, I, I still got Prey, I still got Shyness, which I'm going to touch on within the three days I'm off, because um, I, I do want to play those games. I haven't forgotten about them, it's just that other games have been taking more interest, and with Darksiders 2, I've been trying to beat that so bad, like Prey and Shyness just kind of got, got pushed to the wayside, even though Shyness is a game that I will just, I didn't intend to make that my main priority anyway, but when I start something, I damn sure want to finish it. Speaking of games that I want to finish, I may be getting uh, Deus Ex back, um, like the latest one, because it, it, if you guys remember, or if you guys have seen the video on, on my playthrough, there was a complete game-breaking bug that prevented me from progressing in the game anymore, and I couldn't... I, I couldn't continue it. Not because I didn't want to, it's like I literally could not continue it. And I think enough time has passed to where, at the very least, they should have patched that bug. You know, I mean, because the bug is in the video, it's clear as day. It's a section of the map where I had to run to, and the, the area wouldn't load. It was even times where I fell through the stage, and it was nothing I could do. I, uh, I, um, I restarted my game, I took it out, put it back in. Uh, you know, even deleted my save file. Uh, of, of course, I uploaded to online storage first, and then I deleted it, and then I um, I re-downloaded it back to my system, and then I reinstalled. You know, uh, reinstalled Deus Ex. I did all that, and the bug was still existing. So I, I, it was something that the developers didn't uh, they didn't catch during their beta test, if they ever beta test, because it seems like these days, less and less beta tests are actually happening for a video game, unless it's a fighting game or something, and even then they don't go to the extent that they should when it comes with, um, with taking responsibility for catching these bugs, and then if they did, they wouldn't have to worry about doing so many post-game patches, but I digress. So... They're gonna be, there's gonna be some rank matches in fighting games this week as well. Cause I think I did enough player matches. I think I didn't played around enough in player match. I'm, I'm actually eager to get back my Bianco rank that I had in, uh, in Tekken Revolution. I, like I want to be a Bianco again. So at the very least. Um, so I'm, I'm kind of aiming for that. You know, that's my, uh, Ranks up because I'm more than capable of doing it. 
And I think it's even cooler that I'm using a character that nobody else is really using. Like, Tekken 7 has been out for how long now? And I've only seen two other leagues, one other legitimate league. I think the one of the guys that was, that was using me was just, just testing them out for a bit. But another guy, he seemed like he was trying to main them. You know, like I've been a Lee main since Tekken 2, so I know all his ins and outs as far as his basics. Um, I'm trying to get good with Leo again because that was my second main when Lee wasn't in Tekken for a short period of time. Um, League of Legends. I still play that. I don't record any of the matches because I don't really have anything to record with. Um, I try to, the, the matches end up getting laggy and I can't really perform in the matches the way I want to. But I've been winning a lot. And I, and with all these changes they got coming to, to, uh, to that, I think in October I may be able to get my gaming laptop finally. Because um, I, I ain't going to lie to you guys, I need it. Like I need it bad. Like my, my current laptop keeps breaking. And, you know, like, it's at the point where it's falling apart again. I don't know how many times I can super glue that damn thing together. Like, I use Gorilla Glue to hold it together, and it works for about, like, a few weeks, and then all of a sudden, you know, <laughs> it's still working right now. It's just that you got to hold it in place and shit, and until the glue dries, and then it's a nice, tight bond for, like, a couple weeks, almost to a month, and then all of a sudden, it just goes put it in. Like, I just can't help it. Like, but I wonder how much better my streaming capabilities would be, my my video editing programs would work if I had the proper you know, hardware as well as the proper internet. So, I mean, the GoFundMe is still going on. I will be making t-shirts soon. So you guys uh, keep your eyes out for that, because, you know, I don't know how to set up, like, the donation streams and all that other shit, and you guys should know I'm not really big for, like, the donating asking as, as it is. I barely promote the GoFundMe as it is. It's there. I would like for people to donate, but I'm more so of, like, a humble soul when it comes to donations. I, 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 at the very least, I want, you know, I want you guys to, um... At least make sure everything that you got has to be taken care of before you uh, even think about donating to me. Like, can you spare the extra five dollars? So you know, like, can you spare the ten dollars? Can you spare the twenty? You know, can you spare the hundred? You know, like, we really like. I'm more concerned with if your lights are going to be on or if your family members are going to go without food because you donated to me. Because I know they got some people out there that gets donations. And the people that donate to them are so into them that they don't even take the time to actually second, you know, to think, like, okay, I don't think I can spare this. I shouldn't do it. And at least not now. But, um, but yeah, I, I would like to, uh, you know, just, uh, I would like to get the help if I can, you know, if I can. That's what the GoFundMe is for, but, you know, I don't want you guys to just donate for nothing. Like, of course, it's going towards the equipment and things that I need. Like I said, I'll be very, I'm very transparent with my purchases. Anytime I got to, anytime I need to do an unboxing video, most definitely I do it. Um, I get the chance to, because I don't get to do many of them, especially this year. You know, like my focus has been on this hardware, because I've been needing it so bad. And uh, I might be able to catch a break come early October, which is going to be wonderful if I can. But uh, besides that, um, I think that's the uh, that's the extent of what uh, of what I have to say about everything. Um, I don't think there's really nothing else to touch on uh, besides. I guess, like, comment, subscribe, if that, you know, is what you, like, if, if you need me to tell me, to, te if you need me to tell you to subscribe to the channel, 
and you're watching this, you know, just click the subscribe button. <laughs> I don't like being annoying when, you know, I, I feel like I'm annoying people when I keep saying like, comment, subscribe, like, comment, subscribe, like, you know, sound like a robot or some shit. I'm, I'm good. But, uh, yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys will continue to support and watch my content. I know YouTube kind of sucks right now with this ad apocalypse that they got going on and all of the little bullshit with their algorithms. Their useless, fucked up algorithms. But uh, I'm trying to make it work in a fucked up situation. So thank you guys for watching. Um, peace, and I'll see you guys for gameplay.